Ja. 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 I've changed my music to from the SD card, which takes an extra click, and I check through that all I have to do is turn this on. This is my MP3 player. Turn it on, and look that that hourglass rotates, and then because I'm playing through music and not my SD card they're instantly on get any of that <laughs> I, I got half of it you got the other half Ooh, what time is it I never check alright I got metal Yeah, I got metal. Yeah, and that's what I care about is metal. Drinking in metal. And... Yeah, drinking metal. And... <laughs> I gotta say it because I don't have to. Yes. Yeah, somebody was living in it. Not living. Somebody bought this fire department. And, uh, yeah. Nice, nice. That's what I would put out in front, too. Look at these walkways. Come on, people. Get your shit together. Fix it, that shit. That's not a good. Doesn't make the town look good, but yeah, I guess that's a regular little town in America. Whatever. It's just me. And I'll be forgotten. 20 years. You heard me. 20 years I'll be forgotten. Because I won't be here in 20 years. that I'm 69. <clears throat> so I brought in, I have my license. I got my YouTube page cards. And I have my license, so I gave it to her. Right, look right here. Now she says, I still don't believe it. <laughs> okay. Wow. 
I'm gonna look young as hell to uh, other people. Like, I don't know how other people stuff that I don't like. Almost 70. Yeah. I'm almost 70. Yeah, as long as I stay handsome forever, I don't give a shit. Bother me. Motorcycles. <clears throat> yeah. So, uh, another guy came into the bar that I don't recognize because I've seen most of my regulars. <laughs> and, uh. Yeah. Holy yeah. shit, that's what you at the bar for. So anyway, oh shit, I had two thoughts in my head that I wanted to say and forgot them. And never to be thought of again. I'm telling you right now, I'm not going to say whatever I might have thought of, I can't bring it up on the back of the old noggin because it's not like the computer. What did you say two, two months ago? Oh, here it is right here. It's in the discussion on a video. Don't get me wrong, but this is it right here. <laughs> guys, let me go through. Thanks, man. So anyway, <clears throat> wow, two things that came to me in my head all of a sudden at the bar. I cannot. I was uh, in another conversation and went to that other conversation and came back 30 seconds later and boo. What did you want to say? I can't remember. Anyway. Yeah, it kind of frustrates me sometimes that I just come up with think of a say. Well, if I wasn't drinking, I'd probably remember. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's going to happen. Let me see. Oh, baby. So, today is Tuesday, August 18, 19. My week as usual, nothing but mowing lawns and watching TV. And mowing lawns is the same because they do the same lawns every week. And watching TV is the same because I watch the same crap on TV. Lately, I've been watching some of the Amazon Prime movies. Uh, I got a smart TV six months ago. And now I have been watching a couple of movies and series here and there off of the getting away from the cable. I have cable television, the basics, internet, the basic, 100 me megabytes per second, and I have telephone. I don't have a, I don't have a phone, a uh, cell phone, so we use a landline. $174.65 my bill is every month for that service. I watch maybe 10 channels on the television and I get billed for all 300 of them. <laughs> yeah, I do. Just like the abortion clinics. Or I should say abortion clinic, but Planned Parenthood. Is why am I paying for somebody to get an abortion when 
I don't have a kid that wants a baby and is in the abortion clinic looking to get rid of it. Why should I pay for it? Yep, so I will anyway until I'm gone. And that's what it's all about. Yeah, you heard me. That's what it's all about. And I say this every time I go out on video, I get stupid. Not stupid, but I get get into deep thought as far as what the world will be like in the future as far as how people will contend with their neighbors. Oh, we hate everybody. How can we help to get ourselves out of the Middle East and at the same time bring our boys home and live for ourselves? We can't do it if we're inundated by illegal immigrants. That's not what I feel, how I feel about it, or anything other than it says on the online, everywhere else, illegal immigrants. I just don't see it, people. They're coming to a fantasy world because we're going to crash because somebody needs that vote just so that they can come up and ruin the country worse than it is. You can't tell me that all of a sudden, during the Obama administration, that your, your unemployment rate was 10%, and it came down little by little by little, and it was six, six point four. All of a sudden now, at the end of your administration, pow! Uh, yeah, yeah, pow! Your three point something, eight, nine, unemployment. Four point oh, unemployment. By the end of your administration. And then, to make matters worse, Trump doesn't come in and say, oh, that was wrong. The real unemployment rate is six something. No, he goes along with it and it says it's 3.9, 3.8, and oh, it's 3.4 now. And I've done a good job at promoting Americans working. Boy, you guys are just finagling, finagling, and just magicians because you know what I'm telling you guys to do you want America to grow you want Americans to work close the borders and if you want to buy in America you buy American you want to live in America you work in America you work with America and you be an American and you don't think about Wow. Those guys overseas are making better parts than I am. No, because they don't do it. You are the only supplier, Americans. <laughs> I just don't understand it. Americans have to work in order to bring in money to pay the bills. And if there isn't any income, there ain't going to be no payment of the bills. So in order to make some income, you have to have that person working. And if that person is working under a, le a legitimate business and producing something, has a production that that product is good, and if they can pay this person and make money at that company in order to have that person get a raise over the years and uh, a promotion over the years, but there isn't any work in America. There isn't any work in America. Pennsylvania's dying. Baltimore is the worst town in frickin' America, as, or city in America, as far as being American. Right, they have a crime rate you wouldn't believe with the, the cops being at the top of the list. <laughs> Did you get that? Yeah, really. I know. Gary, watching your videos, you don't know what you're talking about. You're talking about Baltimore, baby. I can go through the fences open. Yeah, I'm going through today. Fences open. What did I just tell you guys? Fences open, I'm going through.
What? Where's my helmet? What? All right, we're done. I'm hanging out for a little while. I'm going to go throw metal. Yeah, I don't give a shit either. <laughs> That's metal. <laughs>